now from South Seminole Academy in Castleberry, Florida. Direct from the third floor of building number three, this is South Seminole News. Good morning, Hurricanes. Happy Tuesday. I'm Juliana. And I'm Chloe. It's August 24, 2021. Welcome to South Seminole News. At this time, please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Let's check in with Demaya for the Daily Report. Good morning, Demaya. Good morning, guys. Today's weather is cloudy with a chance of rain and no forecast. It's warm out with a high of 90 degrees. Keep the umbrella close by. A reminder, if you take any photos of yourself this school year, send them to us at southseminole at yahoo.com so that we can put them on the news. Now let's take you to the South Seminole Lounge for the lunch report. Good morning, guys. Do you start? Good morning, everyone. Today's lunch special is chicken or beef burrito bowl with toppings. All meals include fruit, vegetables, milk, or juice. A reminder to all students that today's schedule is 1, 3, 5, and 7. If you have any questions about your schedules, please see a teacher. Also, as a reminder, today's lunch is based on your third period teacher. If you do not remember which lunch you have, please, please see your third period teacher. That's all for today for today's report. If you or your class would like to record anything here in the South Seminole Lounge for the Friday afternoon show, please contact the newsroom. You can find the Friday show every week on YouTube at South Seminole News. We'll see you next time. Now back to you in the studio. Thanks. Once again, you will find more news from the South Seminole Lounge every week on the Friday afternoon show. Be on the lookout for a different segment every day of the week. The Dean's Den on the Friday afternoon show with Mr. Fernandez and Ms. Peterson, Mindset Monday with Dr. Coleman, and new segment called Deep Thoughts with Dr. McDonald on Tuesdays. Win Win Wednesdays with Ms. Reed, Mertz MVP on Thursday, and Fabulous Friday with Ms. Mafoose. Those new shows will begin next week. A message from the SSA Yearbook staff. If you take any good photos, send them to ssayearbook at yahoo.com. If the yearbook staff likes your photos, they may end up in the book. Take all school, take photos all school year and send them your best ones. Good luck, new school photographers. As we go into commercial break, please stay tuned as we play a video about our leadership economy called FBLA, which stands for Future Business Leaders of America. We'll be right back after this. We learn the skills we're going to need in our future. We learn about different subjects such as business and finance. It helps you meet new people and it sort of pushes you to learn more. I think it's a great opportunity to learn business skills, proper etiquette, the experiences of competition, fundraising, our community service. It's just an amazing experience for the kids. It's really awesome. It's fun. You learn so much. It's really putting me ahead. The thing I think I get from that BLA is getting to meet new people and learn different parts of business. It is important so when I'm older, I'm able to become a business leader. It rocks. It's the funnest organization I've been in ever. Future Business Leaders of America is an organization that allows students to get in touch with the real world through job shadows, competitive events, conferences, I was one of the charter members at our middle school chapter. It was also neat to get that edge in before I went to high school, so I kind of already knew what to expect. What I love about FBLA is that it donates to different charities to try to help other people, like the March of Dimes. Giving back to the community that gives so much to us is so rewarding. 
you compete, you come to workshops. You actually see how much you know when you compete against different people. At the end of the day, you feel like you've accomplished something. It's just that feeling of, I did it, like we're here, like we're at Nationals, this is amazing. That was it. That was like my shining moment is winning first place at Nationals. It would be an experience that is unlike any other because it really exposes them to a greater world, a bigger world. Welcome back. If you are interested in joining the Future Business Leaders of America, please sign up right away. You may, you may sign up with Ms. Reed in the front office by Friday. A message from Mr. Motley. Every Friday during eighth period, students will be picking up your recycling. Place a box outside your classroom after 3 p.m. on Fridays. If you need a recycling box, please contact Mr. Motley. A message from Ms. Smith in room 204. Any students and teachers and allies that are interested in attending the first DSA meeting, please stop by on August 27th at 8.45 a.m. The DSA is a group for LGBTQ2S plus members and their friends. Everyone is invited. Come join our safe space where you can chat to chat, socialize, and learn. Once again, that's in the room 204 on August 27th. Please see Ms. Smith if you have any questions. All students interested in running cross country or track for South Seminole Academy should attend the informational meeting on Thursday, August 26th from 4.15 to 5.15 p.m. in the gym. If you have any questions, contact Coach Payne or Coach Jackson once again. Meeting will be on August 16th, af right after school in the gym. That's all for today. Make sure you check us out on Instagram, YouTube, Twitter, and TikTok at South Seminole News. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Also, like the South Seminole Academy and PTSA Facebook page for more info. And students, every day here at South Seminole Academy, we strive for success. Take responsibility, opt to lead, respect others, and make good choices. Thanks for watching. I'm Chloe. And I'm Juliana. Have a great Tuesday. And, and don't, don't forget, forget to storm! storm.